That, that is the uh, unstoppable takedown that you just saw us purchase, and it is... That's another one of them. Yeah, they, they tend to be significantly more brutal. Like, you will usually hear very, very audible snapping bones. See what uh, Joker has to say. Yeah, see if he's got anything else. Like, because I've usually only come in here once before the uh, finale. The first couple of times I came in here, I always genuinely expected that that was just, you know, an empty TV the Joker was actually setting on top of his head. As it turns out, I think it is. I mean, there's definitely it, a TV there. But yeah, like, in the later ones. Think, I, know, I know it is. Uh, let's see here. We're going over there, so... Yeah, so it, it's not because he funded the place, but rather that he saved a jumper from the location where the bat was at. Well, that's when you found. That's when you found it. Okay. Family's blood ran through the heart of the Gotham. We were doctors, politicians, and teachers. We have been the organ cleaning the arterial filth from the city. We have been its servants, giving all to protect it. And still it has chosen to hurt us. Were those a bunch of skulls back there? Yes. Cheery. I don't know even what to say to that. That man probably put them there. <laughs> Just because? I need a good place to store my skull collection. Are these the kind of things that Batman thinks about? I think it's the kind of thing that all of us should think about. <laughs> yes, Batman is a badass. Technology to airport security, huh? Security deactivated. That would make everybody real happy. Or even better, Arkham security. <laughs> yeah. Actually, it, later on you run into it, and he did. And apparently, also programmed it to let uh, 
him through. Mm -hmm. I really do love this place. This is a fun environment in the game. Is that the bat jet? Could be. I didn't quite get a good look at it. Dr. Young was heading up a project. It was big. Lots of external funding. You're the last known she filed. I can't make sense of it. What does it mean? Looks like she was experimenting on the Arkham patients. This new chemical only barely resembles the original venom compound. There are a number of changes. See, it's spiky. <laughs> Spiky yeah. chemicals are different from non-spiky chemicals. <laughs> now, admittedly, this is great because uh, you do get to see a little bit of Batman doing... I mean, it's a cutscene, sure. But you see Batman doing his detective thing because a lot of times you tend to forget that his IQ is, like, absolutely phenomenal. I mean, he's not only just uh, a fantastic crime fighter and everything, but he is, you know, genius level. Is Joker crazy enough to do that? Why am I saying? Yeah, what are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> and here's our next gadget. That's right, you just keep admiring it for a little while longer. I'm going after go. her. She was heading to the mansion with cash. I'm going up top by its stairways. That meant something incredibly useful could have been in those crates. Or are you the kind of person that just, you know, sticks random crates around? <laughs> that was the supply of replacement robins. <laughs> he goes through them like... Blow up robins? <laughs> oh! No! Why would you say something like that? You're a bad person! Batman's not gay! Yeah, Batman's not gay, so you just shut your whore mouth. I kind of half expected that while he talked to me to just explode in his hand. You are a problem with my generous nature. Uh, no, um, I, I guess not. Uh, uh, thanks. Oh, don't mention it. Let's just consider the matter closed. Did I ever tell you the one about the guy who came home to find his wife? A paraplegic? <laughs> Joker, your jokes are to hair bad. They're bad. They're just bad jokes. <laughs> they do tend to be, you know, scattered around. So, as you can see, you can also use the Bad Claw in combat. Uh, a lot of the equipment that you pick up along the way can be implemented into the counter system, or a uh, combo system, which is pretty interesting. I think about the only one that you can't actually is the explosive gel, or at least not directly, and as we've seen, we can find ways to implement it. Yeah, that into combat pretty effectively. Yeah, no, when it comes right down to it, the, um, all of his gadgets are pretty useful throughout the entire game, not just for their uh, specific purpose. Yeah. A challenge completed. Can you okay. do more? I guess that was just a riddle or trophy hidden in a dead end vent.
Well, we won't go that way. Yeah, that sounds like a bad way to go. But as you heard very briefly there, that was one of the interview tapes that you can find scattered around Arkham, which are literally just patient interviews and uh, psychologist analysis of uh, the different Arkham inmates. You can get a lot of interesting background information from those. Some of it is actually incredibly disturbing, um, and there's some occasionally many stories being told, like in the case of Zaz. Yeah. His is fun, and uh, probably one of the better ones is actually uh, Harley Quinn's interview tapes. Uh, hers you find from the time that she's interviewing Joker, and you can slowly actually pick up on her from tape to tape, uh, losing her mind, uh, see Joker's influence growing a little bit more and more each time. It's really fascinating. There! There, it only took you Take like, it. like, what, six? Yeah. Good job. That was plenty. Uh-huh. Yeah, you can thank God for your unlimited supply of batarangs. This is actually one of my least favorite parts of the game. It's, it's Primarily because it's yeah. basically just a jumping puzzle, and you can't use your uh, grappling hook. Excuse me. In, in a significant number of places, at any rate. The idea is that the uh, structure is just a little bit too old, and too weak to support her decent grapple hook, so uh, it just falls off. Hey, this is weird. The payments to Doc Young's account didn't stop exactly. Now, admittedly, because we are not going for all of the Joker trophy or Riddler trophies, I think that's like the third time I've said that. Yes. <laughs> Since we're not going for all of the Riddler trophies and all of the various um, uh, challenges, this room is going to be significantly more bearable because I've burned well over an hour just in this room looking for all of the trophies and all of the hidden secrets. I'm not sure if I actually picked up on that before. Okay. <laughs> Just her kind of indignation about jokes and about wheelchairs. Joke about wheelchairs. <laughs> it's like somewhere between bitter and, you know, amusingly accepting. Four. Five. Six. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, no, no, it's fine. <laughs> Just do your thing. I'm having fun. 